final shape right around the corner i wanted to one last time go over what the hunters are going to be getting with prismatic when it comes out i do think the prismatic hunter is going to be one of the strongest classes in the game so let's go ahead and go over it So for the class abilities, we're going to have Marksman Dodge, Gambler's Dodge, and Acrobat's Dodge. Marksman Dodge, of course, when we dodge, it will just reload our weapons for us. And then Gambler's Dodge, if we dodge near enemies, we'll get our melee back. And then Acrobat's Dodge, when we use it, we turn us and nearby allies radiant. For the jumps, we're going to have our high jump, strafe jump, triple jump, and blink. So we're going to have all the jumps all across the board. And for those D1 hunters out there, this is going to allow us to also have blink with arc abilities. So, hey, D1 hunter coming back in the room for the supers we're pretty much gonna have all of them available right so we have a new one coming out that is storm's edge so we're gonna have that that is under the arc subclass we're gonna have golden gun marksman we're gonna have silence as squall silk strike and shadow shot deadfall now for the melee abilities we're gonna have combination blow coming from arc and solar we're gonna have knife trick from stasis we're gonna have the withering blade of course from strand we're gonna have threaded spike and then we're gonna have the snare bomb from the void subclass for the grenades we're gonna have arc bolt grenade swarm grenade dust field grenade grapple and magnetic grenade and for the aspects we have a new one coming in for arc again it's going to be ascension then we have gunpowder gamble winter shroud threaded specter and stylus executioner now of course what we know is prismatic has a new kind of like mode that you can go into called transcendent and that comes with a special grenade so for the hunters we're going to have a hellfire spike grenade so this attaches to surfaces or targets for stasis and solar damage slowing igniting and creating scorch cyclones so this grenade is going to be super super crazy it's going to have stasis and solar abilities coming off of it and it's going to be a huge cyclone of just fire and ice damage now the two supers that i think are going to be worth running on this subclass are probably going to be shadow shot deadfall because shadow shot is just amazing and then we have golden gun marksman for that boss dps okay those are the two that i would probably run especially since we're going to be able to do some crazy exotic armor perk stuff when the final shape comes out now what i want to do real quick is go through some combinations that might be really good with prismatic so starting with the melee the first combination i kind of want to do is actually combination blow and then we're going to throw dust field grenades in with this now the reason i want to do this is because as you guys know we are getting a new stasis keyword with frost armor so if we can throw that in there and we can still use like let's say renewal grafts with the dust field grenade when we get into dust field we're going to get that frost armor plus combination blow we're just going to be punching everything it's going to be a lot of damage okay coming out of that particular build now also with that we can run threaded specter if we wanted to do that as well so every time we dodge we'll put up a shadow clone pretty much and that'll just give us a little bit more burst damage up close and since we're using combination blow guess what we're going to be just dodging over and over again and we're going to always have our melee back to back to back to back so we're going to have threaded specters pretty much up constantly it's, it's going to be crazy so next i kind of want to do withering blade so withering blade then we're going to add grapple melee with that as well so we're going to throw the withering blade slow them and then go in for the grapple melee now everything slowed we have unraveling on the field as well and then we're going to finish this off with stylus executioner so that if we get debuff kills we will go invisible so this allows us to just be invisible all the time while slowing and unraveling everything on the battlefield and we can also run terachnes facade with it so that we can always have woven mail when we use the grapple just to give us a little bit more damage reduction when we're flying in there and lastly i kind of want to do knife trick with ophidian spathe just so we can have two knife tricks in the back pocket and then again i would probably pair this with the dust field grenade and then we'll run gunpowder gamble for some ignition explosions so these are just a few combinations that i'm just thinking of off the top of my head literally like not too much thought into it we're just looking at the abilities and seeing what would kind of pair with each other obviously this is like the very bare bones of the subclass we won't know until we get the whole thing okay let me know what you guys are thinking in the comment section below what combinations and what builds are you guys thinking in those minds of yours yours those beautiful minds of yours that you want to put together in the comment section below let me know that stuff okay that's gonna be it for this video i didn't want this to be too terribly long just wanted to kind of go over it one last time so that we kind of know what's going on when the final shape comes out with prismatic that's gonna be it for this video hope you guys have a fantastic day and i will see you next time